When it comes to interior design, we don't all have the same budget or the same space to work with. But whatever size your castle is, interior design and decoration can make a big difference to the value of your home as well as the overall comfort factor. And getting it done right first time around by a professional can save you a lot of time and energy and help you get that wow factor that buyers are looking for. It's not just homes on the market that can benefit from a professional eye either. A welcoming and stylish atmosphere can set the tone of a retail store and bring extra customers by catching their eye. In an office space, the right amount of comfort and functionality can drastically improve productivity from employees. So hiring interior designers, like the gang at 740 Designs, can be a smart business decision too. So Alex, furnishing a large space can be really overwhelming. Yeah. I mean, it can be hard to know where to start and making sure that the final product looks good can yeah. be really tricky. So what are some professional tricks? Well, people do get really overwhelmed with a large space and they've got no idea where to place their furniture. So we really suggest placing large and oversized furnishings and using a contrast in the space to make sure that you or your furnishings don't get lost within that space. Also, to use lots of occasional pieces such as lamps, floor lamps, side tables, chairs, to really layer the room and fill it up. And so likewise with a smaller space, how do you yeah. expand a room and maximise the space? Well, you've got to make sure that the eye, when it moves around, isn't struck by any obstacles. For example, down here we've used quite a low-line coffee table and entertainment unit to keep the area open and spacious. Then with colours, use soft pastel colours as to not make too much definition within the room. So that's great advice, but what's a really basic tip that anybody can use to instantly improve a room? Well, art's a big thing in helping to improve the overall style of a room. For example, on the back wall here, we've placed one large oversized piece of art to really draw the eye in and act as a focal point when entering the door. As with mirrors, they're really good in reflecting light and add depth to the room. Smaller spaces and little nooks can be disregarded when it comes to interior design. It's easy to think there's not much you can do with a tiny area, but in fact it's just the opposite. By using the right colours and furnishings, you can save a room from becoming a lost space or another dreaded junk room and give your family more actual living areas in your home without knocking the walls down. Knowing what furnishings can help to bring a room together or how to take advantage of an outdoor space to create another living room is a definite craft. Thankfully, 740 Designs are a stylish and clever lot who can help you put together a particular look to give your house the best chances on the market or to create a stylish home to retreat to at the end of a busy day.